Hey guys, EX20 here, thank you for the 500 subscribers! <coughs> or 508, since that noise effect did that. Thank you, noise effect. <coughs> Charming, aren't they? Now let's get on to the nitty gritty business. That's why you're here anyway, or you're just bored watching random stuff. But who cares? Let's move on. Now, of course, a lot of things happened, especially with the summer thing. Hell, Steam did it with the summer event, giving you free goodies for certain tickets you owned. This is what I got, of course. And what I won was certain things. First off, the new Killing Floor character pack, the steampunk versions, for the new Killing Floor. And also, that got updated with Circus Freaks and all the likey. You know, it's very random and crazy. And also, you could unlock Steampunk Frost if you bet 10 achievements plus the map achievements. Or 13 or more, whatever. But, so yeah, Killing Floor got a major thing and it was quite fun. The reason I didn't make a video on it though is because, to be frank, I was completely lazy, so yeah, sorry guys. But I have footage anyway, so you can see on the screen right now. Now let's move on to the other things that they did as well. But first, random headshot! <laughs> They also gave you a spiffy new suit for your robot mate, that was the Berserker suit for a name of a game that escapes me and I can't be bold remembering, so it'll flash the name right down on the screen. Thank you, Tex, you're so useful sometimes. And so yeah, that game is pretty good, even though it's a complete, utter Mega Man clone. I mean, it is almost exactly the same, but it's still good for what it is, so I suggest you guys check it out. Hell, it's a very cheap game, but it's really good anyway for what it is. Our style's nice, though. Now I'm talking off topic. Hooray! And also they gave away some other random prizes. Such as characters, gears, and only one game you could actually win. Kind of a bit cheap. They only had one on there for the tickets. But still, it was fun. Now let's talk about the important things. I also got a lot of goddamn games. First off is Fear Free, which is a freaking epic game. It is really good. I highly recommend you guys play it. Speaking of which, though, I did a let's play with my good bro, Zombie Hunter. Here's a little snippet for you to enjoy. I'm gonna get him. Do something at least. Hello, bitch. I can access. Well, alright, sorry, sorry. Swearing stuff probably to stop you from doing that. God damn it. No. He's nearly dead. Oh. What the hell? Oh, cool weapon. Let's check this. Whoa! Get, shoot. Get, this to, get to the jumper! Oh, it's a laser! Oh! <laughs> get to the jumper. Oh, you got it. Uh, oh, God. Don't let go. I'm full. I need some help. Oh, I've got up. Alright. Where are you, I'm zombie? Oh, <laughs> oh, there you are. Oh, God. You're gonna do it, dude. Oh, my oh. face. Oh, he's <laughs> <laughs> See you later. Bye -bye. I know that was very random. Of course, I will put the link to the first part in the description below. So click it and watch it and be scared. Or whatever you do when you watch videos. Now let's move on to the other things I got. Yippers. I love saying that. And also a game I also got which is completely free so there's no excuse for you guys not to take it is Champions Online Free For All. And that game is really awesome. I mean, it is awesome. I love the creator in the game because you basically can make anything. And who loves not to be a superhero? You can basically create anything you want. You don't have to make it like a superhero tights. You can make it anything epic. Hell, I made some here for a prime example right now. You see? But really, the game is really awesome, and it's free, so you have no goddamn excuse not to try it. Go try it out and see what you think of it. And if you want a game with me on Champions Online, let me know, or PM me in whatever you want to do. Or send facts or money. Money would actually be good for me. But I know you wouldn't. But let's move on. And also, I got another game. Stalker Shadow of Shinobi. Or whatever you call that last word. I can't really spell it, but I don't know if I said it right, but whatever. And it's a really good game. Plus, this is the very first one of the Stalker series. You know, where they all talk Russian and motherland in Russia. I love talking Russia. I don't know why, comrade. But anyway, the game is really good. It can be a bitch sometimes, but I like it. It's basically like Fallout, but way better, and it was way before Fallout existed, I believe. I don't know when Stalker was released, but I think it was way before Fallout even came out, or whatever, you can tell me that. But, yeah, that was a good game too. 
And roughly, that is the end of this little plus message and other stuff. But all I have to say, guys, thank you very much. You're all epic win. Couldn't go this far without you. And for the hell of it, I'll leave you with something epic at the end for you to enjoy. But other than that, keep subscribing, keep commenting, you know the rest. Oh, and plus, check out my DeviantArt page. Links in the description as well. No, guys, have a great day. And catch you next time. For Soviet Russia. The Great Motherland Russia Combat. Oh yes, I forgot something. HOT! Mmm, I would so look at those old de- Oh, yeah, sorry.